but the best hit for the Royals, and it's a meaningful one. Salvador Perez named the fourth captain in team history, the three previous captains behind him. This is, Monty, this is a much bigger deal than people might think. They don't hand out a seat too often in baseball, and, and that's as good a company as you can join. But think about this, that it had been... 16 years since somebody wore a C on a Royals jersey. Well, maybe the other candidate that I would have said at some point would have, would have been Alex Gordon, but that is a yeah. tremendous group of guys right there to be team captains. You have to accomplish a tremendous, tremendous resume in order to even be considered as a captain. And Salvi's still got some gas left in the tank. Yeah, you're right. I think Gordo could have been named that as well. But right now on this current roster, there is one icon. Granky's in a different category, having left and come back. But Salvi has been here his whole career breaking in in 2011. Uh, he'll go down, already is one of the greatest Royals of all time. He is the team's leader, deserving of the C with those three other Royals legends. So let's go downstairs right now, hear from Salvi about the game, but also that pregame honor. It's an honor. It's an honor to be a captain on, on Kansas City Royal. Uh, it's a special for me. It's a special day. I know we lose. But it's a special day, you know. What I say in the middle is when we talk about histories, you know, George Brett, Sweeney, and Frank White, you know, the way they, they play the game, the way they teach us how to play the game, how to have passion for the game, you know, it's, it's something that I want to follow, you know. I'm, I'm going to try to be one of these guys one day. Said that um, they told you or asked you in, in Texas. What was that conversation like? Were you surprised? They skip and JJ, you know, bring me to his skip off in Texas, huh? and they asked me if they want me to, you know, if it, hey, we think you should be the captain of the team, and, and you agree with that? And I said yes. Did any of your teammates say anything to you today about? It? Yeah, they all super excited. They all treat me like a captain before, but now it's different because they got they 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 see the seat. So, not kind of different. What was it like being around those legends? It's amazing, you know. Frank White, a lot of good glow. Joe Bray, Hall of Fame. You know, my swing in Kansas City Hall of Fame. So, it's amazing. I, I think every player in my in major league, at least we have the opportunity to try to make it to the Hall of Fame. If you don't think that way, I don't think you should be in this game. So, that's the way that I look at it. George and, and Frank gave the jersey to Sweeney when he was named captain and then Sweeney was able to give it to you. Um, that kind of passing of the torch, what did you, what did you make of that? How, how special was it today? That's super special, you know, especially coming from my Sweeney. Uh, I know her for a long time, you know. She teached me a lot of things uh, on the field and outside the field too. So it was, it was a special moment for me.